SAP Business One has alerts that are built into the product that can help you manage the business proactively instead of reactively. In addition to that, clients have the opportunity to create alerts that will allow them to track information that's important to them. In this exercise, I have created an alert that allows me to track all invoices that are greater than $5,000 and greater than 30 days past due. Because this is a user-defined alert, I have some additional characteristics that I need to identify. For example, I would path out to a saved query that I would have created within Business One. Now that topic is not covered here, so if you do need additional information on queries, um, look up and help and use the query generator to crea create queries. I need to identify the transaction as being active. I identify who is going to receive the alert. In this case, it's going to be manager. It's going to receive it internally. I can identify the frequency for the alert. In this case, for demonstration purposes, I'm going to set this to trigger every one minute, but you could do it in terms of hours, days, or weeks. But if you choose days, it says, okay, if you're going to run it every day, at what time would you like to run it? Or if it's going to be every week, what day of the week would you like to run it? And at what time? But we're going to continue with one minute. And I can also choose to save history. Now, if I mark this button, what will happen, and I'm running the alert every um, hour, at the end of eight hours, I will have eight alerts within my inbox. If I remove the checkbox, I, at the end of eight hours, I will have one alert in my inbox, and that alert will contain the most up-to-date information. So it's whether or not I want to be able to see the changes throughout the course of the hour or do I really just care about the most recent information that's being presented. So at this point I'm going to go ahead and choose update. And in a moment here our alert is going to trigger. At this point we can see that our alert comes in notifying again me again the name of the alert invoice is greater than 5,000, greater than 30 days past due. And from here I have the ability to drill back and view that particular invoice. And just as a side note, I could also create through an, a right mouse click an activity to have someone follow up on this particular invoice as well. But for now just realize that Business One will notify you when or the transactions that meet this criteria. So again, it's another way in which Business One can help you use the alert functionality to track information that's important to you. I encourage you to also monitor the other videos on just alerts in general, talking about the uh, predefined alerts within Business One. And I also encourage you to view the videos on using approval procedures to manage the business where like the name implies it triggers uh, approval in order for the transaction to take place uh, where you can also do user defined approval procedures as well now what you had seen here is as I would mentioned is one minute and the history button was not checked so that's why even though we heard a beep here we still only have one item in our inbox and you'll see it still contains the same data thank you for attending this session